Hey YouTube, what's up? Kayla, aka Silhouette Namiani here. Um, in my first video, I mentioned that I was going to have other videos for the projects that we do in Coca. So, I'm going to talk about the first project I published right now, presented, whatever. And, um, it's a monthly themes project where basically all it is, it's really simple, but every month I present a new theme for, um, different things that can cause depression or suicide. Like, the first month, January, I referred to it as Freedom of Love Month, and it's basically people who get bullied and get depressed and commit suicide because they're gay or bisexual or transgender. And really it was, um, February was, um, because it was Black History Month, I had, like, race hate and racial discrimination, and then March was ethnic stereotypes, and now April, this month's theme is child abuse. So they're all, like, different things that can cause people to be depressed or commit suicide or anything like that, any form of bullying. There's other ones, there's cyberbullying, there's teen suicide because of a breakup or a bad relationship or whatever, and there's all kinds of stuff in months coming up, but basically all you do with this is I'll present the theme and basically what I ask people to do is look up research, look up statistics, look up actual cases where suicide has occurred because of the theme. And I ask them to post the links for whatever they find on COCA and on their Facebook page. Um, we uh, have different photo albums, and I have one that's for the monthly themes, and if you find a picture that relates to the theme, you can post it in there. And one thing I do, usually, is I'll have um, my cover photo on Facebook, because I have the timeline. So the cover photo will have something to do with the theme. Before I had timeline, I had it as my display picture, but now I have it as my cover photo. And then in COCA, every month the uh, cover photo for the group, ha it states what the um, theme is there, so you don't have to go like scroll through to try to find where I posted what the theme was, so it's right there for everyone to make it easier. And, you know, people put video YouTubes that they find, some people make video YouTubes, or video YouTubes, that, that was a really stupid thing to say, but yeah, make videos and put it on YouTube, is what I meant to say, probably. I don't know. <laughs> but, um, do stuff like that. And really, the main thing for it is to raise awareness of it. And, you know, if it really spreads around and people start reading this stuff, then they'll realize, hmm, you know, it really does have an effect. And, you know, it's really just to get people to think about it more and hopefully you know, change, you know, because sometimes, like, you'll say stuff and you don't even realize how hurtful it can be sometimes, or how judgmental you can be, but when you start reading these cases and everything, you're like, wow, that's messed up, and then, like, when you start to say stuff like that, you think about it more, and then you realize, hmm, I shouldn't say that, and then you stop saying it, of course. So that's really the uh, point of that, is just to raise awareness and make people think about it more and hopefully, you know, the bullying for it will back off. People will judge a little bit less, especially with um, a lot of these cases that people find when uh, the kids commit suicide. There's a lot more to them than what people realize. And they're like, wow, what what right did I have to say that to this person or, you know, whatever like that. And other people to go and read this and, you know, see how some of the people who were involved in it feel. They're like, you know, I don't want to be in that position, you know. So, I don't know. That's mostly the theme of that project. That's the theme of the themes is just basically raise awareness and stop doing it pretty much. I mean there's even stuff I've read where I'm like wow you know I can be kinda harsh sometimes too and I'm trying to work on that too so it's been helping me even so hopefully it's helping other people become a little more 
accepting and open-minded and you know for other people with these problems to come and read some of the posts we put up like I know there were some gay and bisexual people in COCA who you know some of the stuff that we were posting about people being accepted for who they are and not trying to change them you know there are some people that really appreciated some of the stuff that was posted and it made them feel better for you know who they are and what they are and you know hopefully some of the posts will help people with these situations feel a little more comfortable about themselves feel a little more comfortable talking about whatever it is with them you know and it's basically it for that project you know no real big thing it's not complicated just follow the themes and keep Facebook updated a bit. You don't have to do a lot, but my dogs are barking. Shut up. <laughs> Alright, well, yeah, that's basically it for the themes, so I'm gonna go make the dogs shut up now. Bye! Peace and love.